What's up, guys? Sloppy Wet Blow here. Um, I get I get some requests about people having issues with drivers sometimes with installing. Uh, best way to put the drivers in, clean install. A um, couple things. Just gonna be a quick video, but I want to help you guys out. Something that I've always done that I think is a really good um, method to make sure that there's no kind of driver conflict when you guys put your drivers in. Uh, this works both for in Vitas cards and the um, ATI or AMD cards. Um, right now, I just put the new video card in. I have the uh, the uh, for the win version of the GTX 670 in the computer. But what I want to show you is, if, let's just say you have a current configuration. It's not a brand new install. What I want you to do is a really good program that I always use is called Driver Sweeper. I'm going to show you how it goes. Uh, you can get it from download.com. It's a free program. They don't even update it anymore, but it still does such a fantastic job. Put it this way, when you uninstall your drivers from the control panel and you go rebooting, Driver Sweeper will still find at least 30 to 60 files still sitting in there that can cause a conflict. Will it? Maybe not, but why take the chance? That's what I say, right guys? So as I'm going to show you right here, here's Driver Sweeper. Again, go to download.com to find it. It's called Driver Sweeper. All right, let me show you how it works. It's very simple. As you see here, all it is is you're going to check off what you got going on. All right, uh, a lot of it is miscellaneous. You're not going to really use. I don't recommend digging into. But as you see here, you got Invita Display, Invita Physics, which is always two things you're always going to install. Display means the graphics driver that's attached to every uh, firmware or every time there's a driver release. That's what it means. Chipset, don't mess with, because if you have an NVIDIA chipset, it'll screw it up. We're not touching that. But all you're going to do is, if you got AMD, there you go, display. And if you got NVIDIA, uh, you're going to check off this. You're going to check off this. You're going to hit Analyze. What it's going to do is, now again, this is after you've already run the control panel, uninstall the drivers first, uninstall it, reboot, Use Driver Sweeper, like I said, check off Display in Physics, hit Analyze, and then Clean. And then it's going to ask you if you want to reboot, close the program, and run it again. And you'll get to the point where it shows nothing. Okay? Like I'm going to show you here fast. Okay? See, it sees one file, Clean. Now, I already did it. I just figured I'd do a video to help you guys out. When it says reboot, it means you're going to reboot your computer, okay? Yeah, that's all you're going to do. And then what you'll do is you go into the program again, let it run, and do it again. Hit Analyze and Clean. Again, it's called Driver Sweep, a fantastic program for removing stuff. All right, now, I already started the new driver, which came out, the 30448. So what I recommend you doing is actually, if you don't have any kind of 3D device, don't download the 3D Vision or the Vision Controller or if you use onboard sound um, then you're going to update the audio driver. If not, don't. So what I always do is just do the graphics driver and Vita update and the physics software driver and that's it and hit next. Alright? So